Hey, what's up, everyone? Kobanaman E456 here. Today, presenting to all a new episode of Sonic Generations PC Mod Mondays. As for this video, we are going to be trying out the Sonic Freerider Shadow Mod from Dakuneku, and also the Splash Hill Zone Stage Mod from Sonic Boom 5. So, if you'd like to try them out for yourself, the links are in the description below. And if you all would like to keep on seeing more Generations mods weekly, show me and hit that like button. At least we're going to be like over 3,000 likes for this video. But anyway, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. By the way, I'm actually thinking about doing Smash 4 and Sonic Generations on Mod Monday, so if that sounds, you know, pleasing to you all, let me know down below. But uh, anyway, we are in the hub world of Splash Hill Zone, and it looks pretty awesome. So it's, uh, you know, specifically made for this stage alone, but really, really nice that, uh, you know, Sonic Boom 5 actually did take the time to make, you know, a hub world specifically for this stage. You know, it's obviously not necessary, but it's always cool to see when mod creators actually do put that extra effort in. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and get into Act 2 of this. Or, wait, what the heck? Oh, I pressed B. Oops. <laughs> Alright, this is my first time playing this, so I'm actually quite excited to see what it's like. Wait, what the heck? Dude, why, th why this Shadows Run looks so trippy right there? <laughs> Did you all see that? But alright, so I believe this music is actually made by T. Lopez. If you all don't know who that is, that's actually the guy making the uh, soundtrack for uh, for uh, Sonic Mania. So pretty hyped to see that, you know, he's still working on, uh, you know, fan-made stuff like this. Alright, so from what I'm looking at right here, it looks like we have multiple different pathways around here. So um, definitely a lot of replay value here. And then also just the really, really cool dynamic camera angles as well. That's really, really awesome to see. But uh, right now, I'm a little bit scared because I have no idea what's going on. Um, I guess we took the slower pathway because we're on this 2D plane. And you all know what happens when uh, 2D happens. We get ourselves uh, platforming and whatnot. So, yeah. And then, wow, I just realized... Wait, 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 wait. It's not just... Oh, no! What the heck? But see here, look at how many... Ah! Whoa, what the... Ah! Huh? Okay, what's going on here? What's go ah! All right, so we're gonna try this again because I really really want a flawless run uh, <laughs> Well, not a flawless, but you know a solid one to where we're not dying literally every few seconds You know because I have no idea what's going on here. This is my first time playing through this stage I actually didn't even watch the trailer for it All I know is that there are a ton of alternate pathways, which is really really cool because I mean look at how big this is Look at wow dude I can understand why it took an extremely long time for this to be done, because the amount of time and effort put into this is definitely showing around here. Alright, so I'm gonna stump there so we don't end up dying again or anything like that, because there are actually quite a lot of uh, bottomless pits around here, and then I don't know if you all know this, but whenever we run in 3D, um, oh god, okay, whoa, what the heck, that sent me flying backwards. Um, whenever we uh, run in 3D, we actually have no rails to kind of keep us on track. So if you're not cautious, then you're bound to die. Oh god! Whoa! See there? What? What? What am I saying right now? Okay. All right. Here we go. All right. I'm good. Oh god! No! <laughs> I was a little bit too late to notice that. All right. Let's do this. Oh, and of course, my quick step only makes me quick step in place once. Okay. Well, there we go. That's it. Wow. Really? That was pretty that was pretty hype though. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna try this again actually, and maybe, maybe, just maybe. Huh? Wait, 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 that's an S rank, but oh, because we're playing the free riders. So there's an X rank. Okay. Alright, so now we're gonna actually see if we can get a uh, super shadow quick because um, I've died a lot of times off screen, you know, just kind of exploring, seeing what's up. Because look at that, there's a little shortcut right there. There's so much to find here, and uh, you know, it's actually making it quite enjoyable to play through. Like, I'm not even tired of having to replay through this, you know? I'm actually quite eager to see what else is in store for us. So, that's what I really like when people, you know, put like so much effort into mods like this, like, he didn't have to put, like, multiple pathways, he could have just made it, you know, one really, really linear stage, but here we actually have the, uh, you know, option to decide which pathway we do actually want to go on, so I think that's really awesome. Anyway, uh, alright, so here, gotta be very, very careful because there are lots of bombless pits, though look at that background, man, with 
just the waterfalls on Splash Hill. It looks so awesome. All right, here we go, here we go. All right, we are now Super Shadow people. All right, now, I don't know if I want to... Okay, whoa, yes, holy crap! Why does that look so hype? There's like so much motion blur, okay. Well, let's see if we can uh, kind of hold on to our rings for a decent amount. I could have actually copped some of those there, but you know. All right, here we go. Woo! Whoa, 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 whoa. It was a little bit too slippery there for my taste. Okay, uh, this way? Okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right. Ah, dang it. <laughs> we lost the super form right as, uh, what is it? We're coming to the end. But there we go. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. So really, really fun to see the other alternate pathways on this stage. Um, definitely, definitely try it out for yourself. Like I said, the creator of uh, this mod is Crash 5 Band or Sonic Boom 5, whatever you want to call him. I think that's his URL, Crash 5 Band. But, um... Anyway, that wraps up for this Mod Monday. So thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, you know, let me know down below, uh, you know, what you all thought about this video. If you all enjoyed the uh, mod that we covered, and uh, what other mods you would like to see me cover. As uh, next week, we're probably going to be doing uh, one of the nighttime uh, stages that was released recently. I can't recall the um, creator, but uh, there have actually been a couple of you know stage mods released, and then character mods too. And like I said, I'm thinking about actually redoing some stages from back then. And uh, just adding motion blur to them. So if you would like to see motion blur on future episodes of Mod Mondays, let me know down below. But anyway, as always, thank you all again for watching. See you all. Have a good day. Peace, Republic of Kobanamite. And take care.